rocks. Some rocks have holes. Some rocks have fossils. A fossil is a trace or something left behind from an animal that used to live long ago. And whatever they left behind, whether it be a footprint, a handprint, an armprint, or even their bones or their shells, whatever they left behind turns into rock and becomes a fossil. Many rocks have fossils. Some rocks have lines and layers. Sometimes the lines and the layers can be different colors. Some rocks have wavy or curved lines. Some rocks have crystals. Some rocks are round. Some rocks are not at all round. We call them angular. Some rocks are made of lots of little rocks attached together. So my friends, today we are going to explore, observe, and describe rocks. You're going to go to different stations. At each station, you will sort the rocks into two piles. The piles might be crystals or no crystals, lines or no lines, curved lines or no curved lines, rough or smooth, curved or angular. If you're not sure what it means to put them in the piles, raise your hand and a teacher will come and help you out. After you've sorted all the rocks at your station in a pile, then I want you to look at all the rocks and find one special thing about one of the rocks that you can share with your teacher. After your teacher sees that you've sorted all the rocks, you'll put your rocks back in the bin and move to another station. Rocks. <laughs>